Hi there, my name's Adam from Ascend Data Cabling and today we're going to talk about phone sockets and phone cables. Now this is the older style 610 socket, very common in Australia and it's just the older style female socket. Plug the two in and your telephone works, everyone's happy. Now what often happens is that you move into an older house like this that has a newer telephone with what we call an RJ11 cable. As you can see, they don't fit. So, what do you do? Well, the answer is pretty straightforward. What we do is we get ourselves an adapter. It's called a 606 adapter, and that takes an RJ11 cable, like so. Plug it in, and there you go. You now have a cable that you can plug into your old style socket, and your phone just works. Now, if you're into a newer house, you'll find what we call an RJ11 socket which looks a lot like that if it's wall mounted or if it's a surface mounted one it'll look like that. The end result is the same. You use this cable which is you'll find on all telephones these days and you plug it into the wall socket like so and everything works. Now problems can arise when you get an older style telephone one of these and a newer style socket. Doesn't work. So what do you do? Well, the only thing you can do is go and buy a new telephone cable, which will have an RJ11 connector at each end, and of course one end will plug into the telephone, and the other end will plug into your wall socket. Now these cables are available at any electronic store uh, around the country. Just simply go in there and ask for a RJ11 telephone cable, and the helpful staff will be more than obliging to do so. So that's it for today. We've discussed the 610 sockets in the older houses. We've discussed the RJ11 sockets, which you'll find in the newer houses, and how to connect the cables between them. That's it for today.